Hi, my name is Guido Mendoza. I'm a queer writer, poet, and I also co-facilitate creative writing workshops. And one of the things that we'd like to do in creative writing workshops is teach folks how to write from different perspectives and seek inspiration for many things. So one day I was actually uh, enjoying a glorious sunset and I thought, what if this was a queer love story? So that's what this piece is about. And I think it's very fitting for our voices as our voices need to be heard, but also our voices create stories and as queer people, that's what our lives are. Our own lives are creating stories, breaking paradigms, you know, uh, not fitting into binaries, and just shifting the way that we show up for ourselves. So I thought about, what about using our celestial beings that we get to inhabit and enjoy daily as inspiration? So this is a piece that I call Celestial Queer Love. Earth puts on eyeshadow at dusk for her rendezvous with the moon. She adorns with stars for jewelry. The moon's smile illuminates us. She's been waiting all day for her. The earth trembles in nerves. Despite their deep love of centuries, she still blushes at dusk as she rises. Their dance floor is the expansive sky. The planets drum their favorite tunes. They both sway together in harmony a dance that we all bear witness to. They dance cheek to cheek all night long. We sleep as the lovers swoon above us. While the sun sleeps, they love boldly. If you listen closely at the witching hour, you can hear their heartbeats in the air. As the sun rises, they each go their separate ways, aware that in a few hours, they get to be free again. The greatest love story I've ever seen is hidden in plain sight from dusk till dawn. They're not hiding their proclamation. They know the patriarchy isn't ready for it. The taboo makes it much more spontaneous, like a combustion of celestial beings. That's why our sunsets are so gorgeous. It's the stirring love that we are in awe of. Thank you so much, and may you find inspiration in all the things that are around us and write your own queer love stories. Write your own love stories of your souls, of your bodies, of whatever it is that inspire you. Perhaps this inspired you to write an ode to whatever you see and always keep sharing your voice and always keep writing. Thank you so much. I'm Guido Mendoza and you can find me at Guidoisms on Instagram. Much love.